welcome, welcome, welcome to the Gonzo Book. Welcome to another video for modifications of my Geo Pro 20 FPS. It is model year 20, uh, 23. We got it last year. And my next modification is going to be we're going to change out the microwave. This microwave is a regular microwave, it works fine. Uh, but we wanted a place where we can uh, bake stuff and uh, cook stuff a little bit quicker, like with an air fryer. And we do have an air fryer. It works fine. We love it, but it occupies, it occupies some space. Um, and then we have to move it around. So I wanted to look to see if there was anything like a microwave convection and air fryer. And long behold, there was one. And it was made for an RV. And so I got it. I measured Hopefully I measured correctly, and hopefully it fits in there. If not, I gotta put the old one back in. But hopefully it fits, and we'll have an air fryer convection and microwave right here. And we still have our oven, but we're gonna use our oven for other things like storing the bread and some other uh, items in there. And if you ever wanna use it, it still works. And you just gotta put the pilot on and, and have at it. So, Without further ado, I have to bring the microwave in here. It's up in the house. I took it out of the box. And this is the frame it comes with. It's silver. The old frame is black and black. Uh, but silver matches our silver refrigerator. We don't have one of those. The new refrigerator was all black. So this was fine. And it's going to be a nice tight fit. And it's gonna work perfectly, I believe, right in there. So, hopefully I measured correctly, and hopefully that the uh, microwave fits in there nicely. So, what I'm gonna do now is go get the microwave, set it on the bed, and then I'm gonna turn the video back on, I'm gonna take this out, which I already did once, it's not that hard. Take it out and try to work on the uh, other microwave, which is not going to be hard. I just got to poke the pilot holes in and drill it to keep it keep it set. And that's it. That's pretty much it. And plug it in. Here it goes. Nice All right. Can you see me? Yes. All right, I gotta pull it out a little bit and I have to unplug it. That's the tricky part. These microwaves are for some reason heavy. Turn not to touch any sex, you're gonna scratch something. Got it! No, nope, I don't want to put it there. One, two, three, four. Because it's on the frame, so I'm guessing these screws go on this frame, yep. But what holds this? What holds this to that? See, we got these little holes right here. That's going to have to attach on these holes right here on the side, but I don't see any uh, any screws. The only screws I see are these six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I'm guessing it's the six holes that go right here. They're not that deep. I'm 
gonna have to go up. I need four screws, so I'm going to take these four screws out of uh, this microwave to secure the uh, frame on here, which I'm going to do that right now, see if that works for me. It looks like it can. Here we go, Let's see if it fits. Don't fall on me. Oh, I went in. Okay. Oh, yes. I did it without having to cut it. That is the best measurement I ever did. I'm telling you, it fit perfectly. And if you don't even put screws in there, it ain't coming out. I was gonna get longer screws, but this thing ain't moving. It has a tight fit. Put it just tight enough. Three more screws and that's it, I'm done. <laughs> Easier. Oh my God. There was screws. It was a perfect fit. There was grooves on the bottom and those weren't going in. And I was like, oh man, maybe I can just bend it a little bit. And then when I tilted it, what this, this side went in. I was like, it does fit. So this one came in. Even if these screws don't hold, this ain't going nowhere. So that's a tight fit. I'm talking, it is a tight fit. Cool. Ooh, look how nice it looks. And it's not flush like the uh, small microwave was. It actually, the door sticks out a little bit. But this is nice. This is where it rent, rents out. And let's see. Door opens up this wide. Be nice if it was wider, but you know, most microwaves don't open up that wide. And that's it. I'm gonna try to put everything together as a regular glass rotating 
rotating like that. Just like a regular microwave. Might be standard size. I have another one in my house I can test out. All right. And it has this pan. It kind of looks like that's rubber. I'm not sure. But I'm guessing that's where the air fryer stuff goes. And it fits right on. And it won't move because of that rubber bottom to it. And this thing, and most convection uh, ovens have this. I'm not sure exactly how it works. And it fits right. Fits perfectly on that um, rotating glass plate. And I guess you put stuff on it. Oh, that fits in here nicely too. I'm not sure if you use it the same way, but. Yeah, I gotta read the directions. I have no idea how the thing works. So, take those two pieces out and put them right over here. See if there's anything else. And it does come with installation instructions and microwave instructional manual. Hi, baby. Hi. <laughs> yeah, Chai Reese Maxi shirt. <laughs> Good, babe. Take a look at it. Take a movie of your life. Oh, it looks nice. Very nice. Can I open it? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. 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 Well, we're going to shut it off so it doesn't matter. We just have to when we're at Fort Dix, when we're at Fort Dix, we're going to test it out, definitely. Well, yeah. <laughs> Yo, I'm just telling the folks, man. Oh. <laughs> My outro. Yeah. Alright, so we got the microwave. It was a guess on the side, and I guess exactly perfect. If you do get this one, I'm going to put the link down below and what it is on the screen so you can see it. If I don't know if all deals are the same, okay? So you have to measure it yourself. Uh, the new 2024, uh, they might have a bigger microwave, they might have a smaller microwave. I don't know, so they might have made the hole a little bit smaller. Who knows? So check the size. If you have any questions, Email me or comment below, and I definitely, I definitely answer all comments. So if you comment, I definitely get to you. Uh, so if you want to see, or if you, if you want to wait till after uh, we're done at Fort Dix, we're going to be at Fort Dix on the 18th, and done on a week later. And if we'll give you an assessment of how it works and how the food's cooked and all that good stuff. So if you want to wait till then, so if you're interested. That's high speed, so you got convection, microwave, and air fryer. Yeah. So, uh, without further ado, <laughs> we'll see you on, on the, the other, other side. side. Bye, everybody. Bye.